What's good, Yao Sports? I am matched up with Divine One in a My Team game. Remember that name? First of all, I hope you guys are enjoying your Black Friday. Maybe you're sleeping through this video. We'll find out. But it is 2K Fridays once again, and I'm with my two brothers gaming My Team once again. You're going to see why I took a few weeks off from the normal Yaosh My Team that's more of a value team in the next week. I actually have some surprises coming up with that. I've been saving up some VC and uh, going to have a nice, well-balanced team that I think will will please a lot of you guys. But I noticed right away, this guy has Allen and Igadala and McGee, so this is going to be like a mirror match for me. So I got a little nervous right away. I set everything to play tight for everybody, and I just let it ride, man. It was, it was going to be an interesting game right off the bat. You see Ray Allen and Ray Allen right there. I will be the Ray Allen in the Timberwolves uniforms. I love those classic, like, 95, 96 era around there, Timberwolves uniforms. Getting things started off right. Only not. <laughs> I thought I was, man. I thought I was going to make that with JaVale McGee. But, hey, what are you going to do? I had to get things rolling. That's what I do. And right away, he puts up a nice fight. At the end of this video, I'm going to show you why this was such an interesting game. First of all... Ray Allen on the other team, how does it taste? That was my dunk. I've got a lot of things coming to you guys at Yao Sports, and I've been putting up my team videos on Two Brothers Gaming as well. You know, there were some surprises. You guys are going to see at the end of this video. Right away, though, I, you know, I had to get this guy working on his transition defense. I was playing terrible defense, and we both scored a lot to start this game. I don't think we knew who was going to be our strong suit. For this guy, it ended up being that he wanted to use Stephen Curry, which, hey, I'm not going to fault that one. When he's healthy, he's one of the top five dudes in the league as far as the point guard position and, uh, you know, had an incredible rookie year. Has been bogged down with some injuries recently. But he really liked to do that little side fade shot with Stephen Curry. And I was surprised that it kept going in. I mean, that was really what surprised me the most. Was like, this dude was on fire from three. He was actually doing really well against me. And I was getting a little bit nervous. Like, man, I can't be losing when I'm recording for a my team video on 2K Fridays here. What's the deal? Love Taj Gibson's athleticism. That was a dumb pass, but I got away with it. Russell Westbrook scores and they need a timeout once again this guy's name divine one awesome awesome ended up being an awesome game so i took a break gave you guys some my career came back with some windmills from andre Iguodala. i love playing with iggy and my team because he is such a versatile defender he does a little bit of everything just a lot of fun there we go let's get out on the break that's what i'm talking about I love more than anything just running people into the ground. That's the style that I naturally play. A lot of people say it's unrealistic, but I'm not down with that. I mean, I like to play run and gun style. That's actually how I play. JaVale McGee with the up and under. I've got the moves to follow it up. And, uh, you know, please just trust me when I say, yeah, I turbo with Westbrook. Yeah, I play run and gun style, but that's actually what I enjoy. I loved watching the old Phoenix Suns from back in the day with Marion Nash and Amari Stoudemire. Boris Diaw even, and Leandro Barbosa. I mean, that was the style I wanted to play. I wanted to seven seconds or less this sucker, so the Lakers are going to be pretty good. I don't even need a point guard. Andre Iguodala just went off, just blowing up people, just absolutely detonating the bomb, and we started pulling out to a nice little lead here. Got to pass, feed the beast. The big man is wide open, going to take care of him. Iggy is really directing the flow of my offense along with Westbrook, and I can even hit that jumper with Taj Gibson, but... I didn't even have to worry about it that time. Nice little up and under once again. It's a little bit of a cheesy move this year because you can do it with point guards, but you know the right idea is you know if you throw an up and under move in a real game, you are going to get somebody jumping, especially on that first play down the court. You guys that are real ballers, keep that in mind. Westbrook can hit from three. Morrow's open. Patty Mills is open. We got too many gunners. You know that's going down. The great Patty Mills once again comes through for me. I just did a video where he was knocking down trays like no other. And uh, he is a great backup. Hell, you can even start him if you want. I mean, just a great, great addition to any my team. And a good value, too. He's not going to blow up in real life, but his stats are awesome. Taj Gibson, once again, that baseline. I keep saying his name wrong. Taj Gibson, Taj Gibson. Always screw that up. But the point is, he's awesome, he's athletic, and he can hit jumpers. They kept jumping at him because I knew I could hit him. That leaves other people open. We're playing that little two-man game. Probably should have kicked it to McGee there, but that's all right because Gibson just blew up. Don't give me any 45. That was an and one. What else do you want from me? Steph Curry, get out of my way. I even hit the free throw, and that's awesome. 
Taj Gibson needs that starting spot in Chicago. Just my opinion. Just throwing it out there. You guys can feel free to discuss as you see fit. But I got a bunch more My Team coming. It seems like I'm one of the only guys on YouTube that's doing this My Team thing regularly. You know, putting up a lot of videos of it. Please let me know. I'd like to see some other people's My Team stuff, really. Um, I've seen a few guys doing it. Ray Allen is just shooting from yesterday and draining threes. That's why I got him. Bad pass again by me, but I got away with it. And like I mentioned... Taj Gibson can hit that little mid-range jumper. Nothing wrong with that. I'm always down for big guys that are versatile, and that's why I got Gibson and McGee. Oh, I've got to show him shooting some, too. He was a good player. He kept in this game, kept it to within 10. Iggy almost dunked all over me. I had to save my pride there, but hey, Divine One, you did a good job with this. Awesome job. Even got my bench into it a little bit, though, because I started to pull out to that 10, 12-point comfort zone. And once I get there, I feel pretty good. I feel pretty unbeatable. Um, you know, not that I'm the greatest or anything, but just, you know, he was getting frustrated, I could tell, and uh, had to cheese up one more three just to put it out of reach. At this point, I'm up 19, and, uh, you know, he's getting frustrated shooting some threes and stuff, but uh, honestly, this guy was a good player. He really was. Put some pressure on me in the first half, and, ooh, oh my goodness, they are killing me on that dunk intensity. That's at least an 80. Hakeem Warwick just blew that guy up, man. Even Anthony Moreau is getting into the dunking contest. By this point, it was just kind of a sloppy game, and we just kind of let it go. So, at the end of the day, I didn't even decide to shoot. You know, I wanted to keep that good sportsmanship. And I heard him a couple times at the end say, Hey, Robbie. And I'm like, huh, that's kind of interesting. We take a nice victory, but my team's going really well. Uh, I just put up a video on Two Brothers Gaming. That's X Robbie H 14 x our normal channel called JaVale McGee Goes Off. So you got to check that out. I've got a bunch more My Team tips, pack openings of the purple packs, the gold packs, and all that stuff. But, like I mentioned, this guy was was actually talking to me on the mic, trying to. I didn't have my mic plugged in, so I was fumbling around, trying to find it and everything. And, uh, you know, at the end of the day, Russell Westbrook is your player of the game. About 90% of the time, he ends up that way for me. Speed kills, and he's really a nice distributor on my team as well. I get that penetration with Westbrook, and then I can dish it off to my teammates and, uh, you know, try to end up with more assistant points, but it doesn't always work out that way. Either way, his defense, his speed, his three-point shooting, his athleticism. I mean, in real life, he actually just killed Stephen Curry this past week. Made it onto NBA TV's top ten. He definitely made it onto my top ten this week for my team. I really hope that you guys enjoy that and everything, but... Uh, the surprise for the video, first of all, Russell Westbrook had more assist than points, like I said. Second of all, this guy was calling my name. He was like, what's up? You know, he was trying to get a hold of me on here. So I had to plug the mic in, hit up this message. I got a message from him. I'm like, oops, didn't mean that. So I'm looking through my players to try to find Divine One there. I got a message, and he's actually a subscriber. Uh, it ha It's happened a couple times in various stuff, but never on my team. And he, he hit me up, and he was like, man, I'm actually, you know... A subscriber to your videos I was like all right I got to talk to him so I'm not going to actually show our conversation in here but I just wanted to talk about that real quick I ended up talking to him we exchanged a few tips about my team and that's what it's all about man we really enjoy on two brothers gaming and on Yash sports just talking with you guys about the game sharing experiences all that stuff he was a cool dude and uh hey man sorry I beat you and everything a little bit but uh Hopefully things are going well for you and my team, Divine One. Thank you guys for watching this video, and subscribe for much more on Yash Sports.